Hello fellow gamers, I'm Al Bayel, and today I'm going to take you through how to make your own ARC unofficial server. First, you need to go to the description pane below the video and copy the line of code that I've put in there for you. Once you have this, open up a notepad, paste into the notepad, and then change the following parts. So this bit after the equal sign is your server name. How many players? Server password and the admin password. Try not to edit anything else but those highlighted areas that I've just shown you. Now once you've done that we'll save so when you save it make sure that you change the .txt to a .bat this will ensure that it will save as, as exactly that and you should see this icon if it's been done correctly where you save it is in the steam folder default is the C drive I've got it on a separate drive so if you find the, C, the Steam folder, go to Steam Apps, Common, Arc, Shooter Game, Binaries, Win64, and there it is. Once you've created this, double click it, it will bring up a command prompt window for a split second then it will disappear. That's fine, don't worry about that, because a couple of seconds after that you'll see this command prompt appear. In here, you'll probably see an error message, maybe, depending on your setup. If there is an error message, just Google what it means, and you'll probably be able to fix it that way. Um, but it should look similar to this if it's loaded up correctly. Once this is loaded up, open up the servers window in Steam. Now, this can be done by going to the View tab. And clicking on servers. Once it pops up, go to the LAN tab and then refresh. Now this can take a few minutes, literally mean a few minutes. We can actually, I've actually sat here waiting for a good two to three minutes until this appeared. Once it does however, that means it's seeable by the game. If you set up the ports correctly, which you can see in one of my videos for port forwarding and firewall setup you'll be able to see it in the internet tab also this means that anybody can access the server outside of your network so if you have a friend at the other side of the country they'll be able to see your server in their game pretty neat so just to make you aware when you do have the server pop up in these don't click the connect button the game just sits there lo looking like it loads and it'll never actually load so to actually access the server you'll need to go into your arc game join arc go to the unofficial menu if you've got it set up to be seen externally search for your server and there it is look if it's just a LAN game go to the LAN tab and it'll be there if you've already got a survivor in there then go to my survivors and it'll pop up in there as well so again for the external visibility of your server uh, go to my video on how to port forward and set up the firewall to do this I'll put a link at the end of the video also a link in the description that is how you set up an ARC server if you do have any questions leave them in the comments below any issues again leave them in the comments I'll try and answer them as best I can so that's it I'm Al Bayel and happy gaming